Oh, what an adventure! <laughs> Get lost with Google Maps. Ah, good morning, everybody. It's just on eight o'clock. Looks like we're having a good day today. All right, so I got the uh, wiring of this pump happening now, as you can see. Where it comes out of the trailer, I got a grommet and some flexible cable. Okay, that'll go like that. And on the uh, pump, I've uh, used soldered butt end connectors and connected the uh, this wire to the pump. You can see the ground's got a double on it because this operates the light, so the ground or the earth, this is a black one there, will go onto the double. The red goes onto the output, and the other red goes onto the input of this three pin switch, which is down the bottom there. Everything's got to be long enough. So I can actually lift the cover off. Oh. Um, and and get through the wires because once the cover's back on again, of course you can't get in there. There's no way into this pump. Okay, so I've got the positive, which goes on the output of the switch, the ground, which goes to the light. Okay, and the other ground comes in and plugs in there and the positive goes to the input of the switch. Okay, we had to take the fridge and freezer out, as you can see, they're not there anymore. Um, to open this door, so we could put, uh, hook this up to the fuse box. Now it's all in, wired. We have a, uh, what size fuse do we have in? 10. 10 amp fuse in. Okay, so I'll show you, I'll clarify the wiring in a minute. We turn that on, the light's on. Let's see what sort of pressure we got now. As you can see, that's all dust. Oh, this is the first test of this, so. Whoa. Wow, that's a much better flow, Ziggy. That's a much better flow, love. You can easily get a pot of water out of that if the other pump breaks. All right, lovely. Get that out of the way. If you can hold the camera for me, just, just hold the camera while I lift this cover off and show them quickly. Okay. Clasp the camera. Thank you, Vicky. So basically you can see how it's hooked up there. And there, on that round position switch, number one is the red input. Number two is the red output, and number three is the ground, the, or the uh, negative wire. Right, here we are. we just got to clean all the, the mess up now. And that's not elastic, by the way. It's some sort of Sikaflex compound. we got the fridge and freezer in. I've turned the pump on. So um, it's live. Um, there are going to be some of you that ask, well, you know, if you're out and about, somebody could turn that on and turn the tap on and drain your tank. But they can't. There's another switch up inside there. It, uh, this is not... We can totally independently control the power to all the outside switches and outlets uh, with some switches inside. But I like this black stuff because you can see here uh, the dirt doesn't stick to it like it does with Celastic. Uh, that's why we're using it. Yeah, that's not the neatest of jobs, but hey, 
it's built for going bush not to a beauty contest um, so we'll just turn that on look at all that pressure there's heaps of pressure there there's not much water in that tank um, when the pump was all the way down the other end with that thin plastic pipe that I showed you in one of the videos I think it was the second last one uh, this uh, tap only ever dribbled um, but now it's, it's absolutely beautiful absolutely beautiful all right that's it that's that finished I believe that was the last job I had to do on the trailer so it's ready for us when we go camping again that, that just works brilliantly the missus loves it and that's the important part right there if Siggy's happy I'm happy happy wife happy life all right I'm gonna get back to uh, cleaning up I hope you enjoyed this little wiring video um, it's all fused everything's done good job well by the way I also put me uh, turn buttons around the edge here and on the on the skirt um, as you can see what sticks out the most are the mud guards so I shouldn't knock any of these turn buttons off you have a look down that way and uh, I don't hit me mud guards or anything else when I'm going through the bush because I'm careful. Alright, keep safe everyone. Bye for now.